Alright, what's going on everyone? Welcome to another video. I thought I'd make a follow-up video and I really wanted to, to say a few things. The title of this video is for a reason because it's true. I like in the in the in the wake of um, the video that I made recently, the my, my most recent video, I've had a a lot of inboxes of support. I mean a lot. It's been overwhelming. Um, people just coming from everywhere just supporting me and it's been amazing so I really didn't expect it to be um, to, have to get that much support I would have still said it anyway it had to be said but the reason some of those messages people were sending me I was tearing up they were really heartfelt and um, I think people can read honesty and yeah, the, the truth will defend itself, that, that, and that's that. I just wanted to say thank you. Thank you to everyone for your support. It's amazing. I couldn't mop, I can't, I, I can't believe it. It's, it's, yeah, it's great. It's great to see. But another thing I wanted to make a video about is, so I got a message today from, from a lady who I've met. I've met her and her family, the fantastic family, and she, and she lives here in Adelaide. And she said her daughter is doing a speech for her class. And her daughter's 12. I've met her daughter before. Now she's doing a speech on veganism for her class and I just thought that was epic. I mean, I thought it was so epic. I'll tell you why it's so epic. Not just because she's um, 12 and she's doing it about veganism, because, um, okay, let me read the message. Hi Joey, just wanted to tell you that Jade is standing up in front of her class today to do a presentation about veganism. Jade's worked so hard on it. She has severe dyslexia and talking in front of people is her biggest fear. She's, she is extremely brave. I'm so proud. You have definitely been a huge inspiration for Jade. So much respect. Now, in the wake of everything that's happened, that message just like brought everything back into like focus for me. I was like, wow. This girl, this, this girl Jade, she was bullied. Okay, she was bullied for being vegan, and these bullies tried to stick meat in her mouth, okay? Because I got a message saying, saying that, and she was extremely upset, uh, upset about it. So I, I messaged her to make sure she was okay, uh, to reach out, and send her some good vibes, and she, she was very strong. But th this is what makes it even more epic, this, that she got up in front of her classroom after being a victim of bully, after after being a victim of bullying, and talking in front of people is probably her biggest fear. And she got up there and talked about veganism. It was pr a pr persuasive writing project, so it's to persuade others to go vegan. She could, she could only choose three topics, so she chose slaughterhouses and meat and dairy industry. Wow. She's showing clips and photos of free range. Now, this, I nearly cried when I, when I found this out, because I was so proud, I was like, I'm so proud of you, Jade. That is so epic on so many levels. Like you found the courage to stand up in front of your classroom and speak up for something that really matters. She put all of her personal issues aside and she stood up in front of that class and she gave a talk on the most pressing issue on the earth right now. Okay, and she did that in, in the wake of these of this bullying that she's been copying. And I just thought that that was the most stand-up thing I've ever fucking heard. Good on you, Jade. Like, messages like that, I was like, you know, because it's pretty stressful putting up a video like I did the last video. The, you know, it brings a lot of drama to you. It brings a lot of heat to you. And it was just like, I had to snap out of it and, and bring my focus back. And this message here really did that. So I want... If you all could give her a standing ovation and I honestly believe that this is the start of a really, really passionate activist. She can stand up against and, and show that kind of courage. Courage is feeling the fear and doing it anyway. To come up against um, obstacles like that and stand up in front of your classroom at 12? I didn't have the courage to speak up about this till I was 27. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, or even later. Like even later, like that's what that's what is so amazing. Like to put if you put yourself in her position, how much that would have taken to do that, and that just goes to show where her focus is. And it's just it. 
you know what it is? It's the most flattering, heartwarming thing to know that I am an inspiration in some way to it. Like, just in some way. But I would not take any credit for it because it, it was her. She stood up, she did it. Like, like, it's just amazing. Good on you, Jade. Leave her some love in the comments section. Do it, like, just say, give her some motivation, some inspiration, some support, and just, like, because I just think that that is the most epic thing that's happened this year. Good work, Jay. And I'll see you all in the next video. That's what I wanted to say. That's what made me feel so emotional. Uh, two things, the support from you guys and the fact that Jade overcome those obstacles and stood up against her classroom and spoke about something that really matters. Oh, oh.